the two back looks Charbonnet to the right of Milton and the true freshman Corum motions out. They get the ball to the electric young guy from Baltimore in his first play of his college career. Is an explosive play into Gophers territory. Welcome to the Maze and Blue. First down and goal of the eight yard line for the Wolverines trailing 7 0. And here's the handoff. Corum around the corner. Wow, what a burst. Touchdown, Michigan. I mean, none. Watch it. I mean, Michigan State has him dead to rights right there. And then he just runs around him. Chris Jackson, the corner, over the top of three different Michigan State players. And they run it. Corum, did he get in? Yes, he did. Touchdown, Wolverines. High school basketball player played center at 6'5 in New Jersey. Comes off the field after his second encroachment. Big hole here for Corum inside the 15. Corum back in, 11th play of the drive. McNamara swings at the court. Blocker's out in front. He's at the 10. He's at the pylon. He's in for a Michigan touchdown. This is just an extension of the run game. Kick it out to Corum. He flips the formation. Beautiful blocks downfield by the receiver. They got to win games, and they have to find a way to beat Ohio State. Blake Corum brings it out. Good return. Getting better all the time. Blake Corum is tough to catch in the open field. All the way down to the 20 yard line before he's finally knocked out of bounds. Feeling good about that play on third down. Corum bounces it outside. Corum looking for the end zone again. He's got another Michigan touchdown. And this ball is handed off dead behind that center. Vision cut. Make a guy miss. BYOB, be your own blocker. Put 26 on skates. This guy can make all the throws. I don't care. I don't care <laughs> if you can make all the throws. You got to make the right throw at the right time. A short snap to two. The Huge back. hole for Corum. Goodbye. The one play after the fake punt gets them the first down. Corum goes 67 for a Wolverine score. It's the block by the center. The starters, he's going to come out here. The tight end, Schoonmaker, absolutely demolished their side of the line. And then the speed of Corum surprises the free safety. And Michigan answers with a touchdown. Shift into the pistol. It's Corum running left. Great work by that offensive line. And a Michigan touchdown. Second of the night. Both scored by Blake Corum. This one from seven yards out. And then also, who can step up to take the place of Ronnie Bell? There's Corum with another touchdown. He got walloped. Now he should be flagged. Number 84, watch the other tight end. Eric All come across the formation. Just outstanding blocking by those tight ends. Corum follows all and gets right into the end zone for another Michigan rushing touchdown. 91 rushing yards. It was the winning formula weeks one and two, and they're doing it again in week three. JJ is going to get his reps. As a competitor, of course you're frustrated. You want to stay in the game, but... Look at this. The electric speed of Blake Corum. He turns on the afterburners and goes all the way to the end zone. Tight roping the sideline, 51 yards. Let's make sure he stays in bounds. Look at that. Excellent footwork and excellent camera work by our crew. Getting that look down the sideline. And quarterback trying to guide the Michigan Wolverines into the end zone yet again. Over the top, ball dropped. But once he across, yes, they'll say touchdown. He's across. Jay McNamara said he has no trouble with this arrangement. So it's great that the number two quarterback gets a lot of reps. Here's Corum. Corum with a burst of speed. Touchdown, Michigan. And the Wolverines go back on top. And number 44, he gets kind of frozen here. He, he kind of gets flat footed, he gets frozen. Good blocking on the perimeter by the tight ends and the wide receivers. When we talked to Eric Chenander, the defensive coordinator in Nebraska, one of the things he said, 
Michigan quickly to the line of scrimmage. And they'll give it to Corum again. And it's a touchdown Wolverine. Good push from this offensive line. Just a straight ahead run from Corum. And he goes up and over. Corum, 15 carries, 103 yards, averaging 6.9. Touchdown Wolverine. Coach said. The big thing is that they got themselves the ball in the second half. Beautiful block by Carson Barnhart, number 52. He gets up to that second level. Corb again. Corb with a huge hole. Corb, watch out. Blake Corb, blazing speed. Can he get down? No. But he's down at the Ohio State 11. McCarthy back in at quarterback. Corb the pistol back. Here's Corb. And Corum, what a move. Corum, he needs a block. Corum, down the sideline. Blake Corum, touchdown, Wolverines. 67 yards. What a great block here. Watches this right side of the offensive line. Mashes down. That's Stuber 71. He creates the hole. But, folks, that's not the story of this play. That cut first and then second. Check out the freshman quarterback getting all the way down the field, shielding a little bit. Number nine, McCarthy, helping Corum down the sideline and all the way into the end zone. And Blake Corum is healthy. And that's what happens when you're first-year head coach trying to establish your culture. Right, Robert? No doubt about it. Second and goal. Into the boundary, Corum again, the north south, touchdown Michigan. You're talking about Zach Center and the center, Oluwatimi, pulling around, giving Blake Corum a hole, and when you put him one on one in the open field. Goal line offense on first and goal, the handoff up and over, and Corum is in for a Michigan touchdown. It's Blake Corum and Donovan Edwards this year, and this time Blake Corum up and over. He was in on that last tackle, and now it's Corum getting outside to the 15. Corum looking for the pylon. Touchdown. Check out right here the tight end, Luke Schoonmaker. He's going to come across the formation and just get enough of the linebacker to let Blake Corum get around. And then on the outside, once again, the receiver, Andrell Anthony, throwing a block down the field. Corum again, over the pile, into the end zone for a Michigan touchdown. Two touchdowns for Corum to start things off for the Wolverines. Line getting a little bit of push, opening up just a small gap. Blake Corum sees it, dives over the pile. And they'll hand it off to Blake Corum up the middle for an easy touchdown. His third of the first half. So Ronnie Bell gets you down close, and Blake Corum with a hat trick on the day. As Corum is the eye back looking potentially for his fourth rushing touchdown of the first half, and he has got it. 11th play of the drive. Corum. Cut back. Touchdown number five. And that brings up fourth down. They didn't get it. Michigan quickly to the line of scrimmage. Here's Corum. Blake Corum. See you later. Touchdown Michigan. 33 yards. Blake Corum having a monster first half. They're just trying to get this first down, but watch the vision from Corum. He's going to bounce right there. Listen, Michigan in those, like, one-yard situations, they love to run that. They get down, they squeeze tight, they run straight ahead. It's almost a dive play. But Corum there improvises. He jumps out a gap, sees the seam, and then he is gone. McCarthy gives it to Corum, hits the edge. Corum down the sideline. Blake. And two touchdowns for Blake Corum. And twice today, we've seen in short yardage situations when they had to have it, they gave it to Corum right in the middle, and then he made those explosive jump cuts outside. Takes his talents to the NFL. Corum. And Corum, nice in and out move, Blake Corum. Touchdown, Wolverine. 
game. Because he can, he's he's got it. He can hit you. What did he do, Gus? What did he do? Here, okay, right here, here he goes. Right. Uh, oh, right there. Woo. Okay. All right, Blake Corum. And Blake fake. No, it's Corum this time running with room breaks it back. There he goes. Blake Corum. Blake. The great touchdown, Michigan. 51 yards. First down and goal at the one. He's the eye back. They give it to him. Blake Corum touchdown. Wolverine. Bada bing, bada boom. Power football here. First down and goal at the one. Corum. Can he get there? Corum. No signal yet. No signal. Touchdown, Michigan. 44 Chop Robinson. He's going to come in and get great contact on Blake Holm right there behind the goal line. Abdul Carter is also in there. Blake Corum with the lane. Blake Corum breaks it back. Blake Corum sprinting. Blake, the great touchdown, Michigan. 61 yards. Who's number four all the way down on the outside? That's Kalen King. But the problem is, is that you can block everybody in the run front, and Kalen King is not in position to make the tackle on the interior. So as soon as Corum breaks loose, he's got one guy to beat. It's the opposite safety. They pitch it forward to Corum, and he has his 14th rushing touchdown. And you got three tight ends. I mean, they they move people around, they shift, they motion. Then here comes a little flip to Corum, and Michigan's there. Sign of a well-coached team taking their time. Well, there's still more time they could take off. They snapped it at 12. Corum has the touchdown. Fielded. And Michigan capitalizes, power running. They've had three cracks from the one or two yard line unsuccessful, but they're trying on fourth down. Same formula, and this time, Corum is in. Touchdown, Michigan. Try again. Exactly. <laughs> Keep knocking on that door until someone answers. Again, running behind that big physical interior, those three guys. Four pass attempts for McCarthy, three of them have been deep down the field. We talked about how he's been throwing short passes this year, not to start tonight. How about Corum? McCarthy lays a block, and Black Corum is down the sideline. First and goal, Michigan. They've had touchdowns on all three red zone possessions, trying to make it four for four. Handing it off out of the I formation, second effort. Corum is in. Touchdown, Michigan. See if he stays up. Yep. Can't see that right elbow. That's the only question. Was that down? Uh, there's not enough, I don't think, to overturn that. And I don't think it was down anyway. Malone back for the Wolverines. Two tight ends, two wideouts. yards on that play and they start with Corm and here he goes across midfield showing those skills Todd just mentioned an electrifying run to open the game of 39 yards and the tight end Brennison lined up as a fullback in front of Blake Corum on third down and goal Corum touchdown Michigan An impressive opening drive. No looking ahead toward Ohio State and Columbus next weekend. Well, again, three tight ends, an extra offensive lineman, and a powerful runner. And the opening drive for Michigan goes perfectly according to script. And he runs with the motion man, Bell. McNamara wants some running room for Corum. Blake Corum down the far sideline. And out of bounds. Midfield. Wolverines start the quarter at the 39. McCarthy under center. Corum's got the edge. Blake Corum on the run. Corum might go. Corum to the pylon. And he is. And on the
on the carry for Corum, that foot out before the extension. Just outside the two, they're trying inside. Power to the goal line. Laying on bodies. Looks like he's in the spot, Will. Wow, Let's I thought see. he got in. I thought he was laying in for there the touchdown. Go. Blake Corum had 18 rushing touchdowns last year. Some of this movement and blitzes and schemes here, and this is what they want to do more than anything. I love this about Jim Harbaugh. You know, I grew up in Phil Simms' Bill Parcells era. Fast from the three. Corum straight up the gut. Touchdown. Still standing Blake Corum. You can almost bet on that these days, can't you? Yep. Hit any better than that. 80 yards in nine plays in four and a half minutes. Blake Corum straight ahead. Touchdown, Michigan. Not as pretty, but just as effective. Well, you know, all the movement is nice between the 20 yard lines, but when you get backed up, the movement doesn't count that uh -huh. Corum back in there now after a 27 yard end around. And they'll give him the carry, and they'll give him the end zone. Touchdown, Blake Corum, number three of the day. Today, this Michigan offensive line has made it look easy. Blake Corn, his first carry is a good one. Make it great inside the 25. Corn. End zone. Touchdown, Michigan. Let the light show begin. Let's go back to the score a moment ago. How about this? I could get real technical, but here's the line of scrimmage, all right? It's the five-yard line. Let's just watch what happens. We call this displacing the line of scrimmage. They say if you score with your man, the running back will score. All five linemen in the end zone. How about that? High formation. It's Corn Fighting. End zone. Touchdown. Wolverines. Mistake about it. No doubt. Inside the five, hand it to number two, Blake Corum. Corum up the middle. Touchdown, Michigan. In his decorated career, a two yard touchdown run. The crowd was quiet early. Not the case anymore. It's Corum. Second time today. Strain and loyal. In comes Flip Dixon. Reaching. Touchdown. Another time consuming drive. That took more than four minutes. Right back there. Corum is in. Standing, undaunted, touchdown, Michigan. Right here, he's going to come on a little pulling action. They love to do this. A lot of counter. Pulling the guards. And Mr. Zinter is just hunting. We had a chance to talk to him yesterday. Impressive young man. And as Todd mentioned, a legitimate NFL prospect. Hand off Corum. Corum finds some daylight. He's got some speed and some blockers. Corum down the sideline. And finally, just out of bounds, shy of the 20. Picks up 42. Well, you, you got to respect the running of McCarthy here, too, not just Corn. Corn again. Goes airborne, and he's in. Touchdown, number 10 on the season for Blake Corum. Behind the block by his tight end. Corum in here near the goal line. Second down. Here's Corum looking for the end zone and has it. Michigan on the board now as Blake Corum diving forward. Well, the touchdown will stand for Blake Corum. It will. And look at that guard, Zach Zinter. That is a pro right there. In tight quarters, still the athleticism. Corum in the eye formation, the deep man. Here's the give. Touchdown, Wolverines. Second of the day for Blake the Great.
Talk about moving people off the line of scrimmage. Watch the left side. Barner pushing his man just into the end zone. That's what allows the space. That movement allows the space. Over here is an actual tackle. Trouble with the snap. Corum's got it anyway. Plunges forward. No signal yet. He was clearly in the end zone. And he is. Touchdown, Michigan. A good job by J.J. McCarthy securing the snap because he did bobble it. To put points on the board. 13 touchdowns for the scene. And often in this game in a number of roles. There's a big catch to set up first and goal. And Corum will push it through. Touchdown, Michigan. His 14th of the season. As he's following the, the lead of his fullback, Max Bredesen, number 44. He's low, he's built low to the ground. He, and boy, this Michigan offense hard to stop right now. Back to Corum, Superman over the top, and he's in. Touchdown, Blake Corum, second of the day. Multi touchdown game of his career. Well, he again, he just has such a great feel, and he gets lost. Bredesen at that fullback spot. Corum hesitates, and he's in. Touchdown, third of the day for Blake Corum. He also has the ability to juke you. Watch this cut. He bends it outside, then plants the right foot and cuts back inside. With Harbaugh out, they give it to Corum. Touchdown, Michigan. Blake Corum with a three-yard run. Watch this, left side of the offensive line. They mash everything down, and Corum just gets in there right behind the fullback and the pulling right guard, Zach Zinter. Corum with a hoe down the sideline. Can he get there? Blake the Great. Touchdown, Wolverine. 30 yards. Stopping the run is about being gap sound. Those guys have that gap. Now it's on Chop Robinson, number 44. He's got to have this gap, but he jumps outside of his gap, and he leaves the seam in the defense. That's what happened last year against Michigan. They talked about it, trying to be gap sound, trusting each other, and right there, Chop Robinson jumps outside of his responsibility, and Blake Corum sees it and takes advantage of it. Beautiful run by Blake Corum there, but again, the decision... Corum, touchdown Michigan. Just like that, Wolverines respond. There's your guy. Here he is. There's center. We've been talking about him. Watch 65, mash down and through, and that's exactly where they run. They go over right guard, and Blake Corum in the end zone. Out of the eye formation, 15th play of the drive. Corum, touchdown Wolverines. Short yardage is about angles, and watch how they get the angles by just mashing down with the tackle and tight end, and they pull the play side guard, and then the fullback leads up on the lone defender left. Max Bredesen, the up back, Corum, touchdown, Wolverine. And Michigan strikes first. 21 rushing touchdowns on the year. Well, first you get the block by your best offensive lineman. It's Zach Zinter. He gets a little movement. Then Bredesen, the fullback, 44. He comes in, finishes off Tommy. Corm dancing. Corm breaks a tackle to the end zone. Blake the great touchdown, Wolverine. Here's a look. At Blake Corum. Well, Blake is going to get himself isolated on the safety. This is Sonny Styles. Watch here. Third level move, and he just outruns him to the left. Style takes a bit of a poor angle there towards the inside. It'll be Blake time here inside the five. Watch Max Bredesen in front of him. Great blocker. Corum. Touchdown, Wolverine. Bredesen opening up a hole. Michigan punching it in. Well, here's that fullback block, and watch as he's just going to lead Gorham right into the end zone. Bredesen is loose, and boom, there it is, the big block. Blowing his whistle, signaling incomplete right in front of all the players. So first down and goal at the six-yard line. Blake Corum, touchdown, Wolverine.
And Blake Corum has not had much room all night here inside the 10. Great jump cut to the left side. And there's his 55th touchdown.